g Easy and Machine Gun Kelly become besties in Vegas. Kodak Black becomes the enemy of the hip-hop community. Plus, Will Smith wants in on Old Town Road. Hey guys, it's Devonte for Hollywood Life with your Monday Hip Hop Roundup, starting with Lil Xan. A couple months ago, the rapper and his fiancée Annie Smith announced her pregnancy, and over the weekend, Annie revealed unfortunately she suffered a miscarriage. Annie said in part, I wish more than anything I could meet you, hold you, and love you, teach you all the beautiful things in life, and show you the world. I wish you could have known how truly blessed you were to have a father like Diego. On to a lighter note, Post Malone just got replaced on Billboard's Hot R&B and Hip Hop charts. By himself. Malone's Sway Lee collaboration Sunflower spent 11 weeks at number one, but was knocked down by Posty's solo song Wow that got a significant boost following the release of the music video. And speaking of the Billboard charts, let's talk Lil Nas X because he jumped from number 13 to number seven on the hot R&B and hip hop charts, but of course he still isn't on the country charts. Country star Reba McIntyre reacted to Nas X being excluded from the charts during a press conference at the 54th A. CM Awards, and here's what she had to say. Country music has always been very diversified in the genre of, um, it's one time it'll be very traditional, then it'll be very contemporary, then it'll all go with girls, and it'll all go with boys. And then everything changes up. It's cyclical. But I think we've had that before. I didn't know this about uh, taking it off the charts. I'm very surprised because I think it's been very open in a way except for the women being recorded. It's been a few days since Nas X and Billy Ray Cyrus released the Old Town Road remix, and the internet has been on fire with great memes all weekend. The viral track has become the soundtrack to so many clips, including a mashup of Will Smith's Wild Wild West, and Will reacted to the clip via Instagram, telling Nas X and Billy Ray that he wants in on the OTR music video. But all right, let's talk about Kodak Black. The rapper came under fire over the weekend for disrespectful comments he made about Nipsey Hussle's girlfriend, Lauren London. Lauren London, that baby, though. She's gonna be out here single. She's gonna be a whole widow while I'd be the best man I could be, fuck. I'd give her a whole year. She might need a whole year to be to be crying and shit. To yeah, too for, soon, for right? dude, though. I ain't trying to shoot that hoe. I'm saying this, look, look, look. No, she could do two, three years, but I just try to be that bad. I try to be like, if you need a friend to holler at us, show the scene on eyes. You can call my line. As you can expect, the hip hop community was not here for Kodak's comments. People like the game T.I. and Gilly took to social media to voice their disgust in some pretty explicit ways, so I won't play the audio here. And afterwards, Kodak Black had this to say. It's gonna be my last time talking about this. If I disrespect the youth, no one under, in any shape or form, I'm sorry, even though I didn't. And rest in peace to do my dad to them too. But for all you other people like trying to fake act like y'all little boy me on the internet or checking me on the internet, that's how you feel, bro. That's how y'all want to feel. Rest in peace to do if I disrespect it, knowing that in any way, even though I know I didn't. My bad. LA radio stations have already started to ban Kodak's music with personalities like Big Boy posting lengthy messages about the situation. But okay, let's jump from feuds to friendships because g Easy and MGK have officially called a truce, and we're hearing exclusively Eminem was the mastermind behind the makeup. g Easy and MGK spoke for the first time since feuding backstage at Chaos at the Palms Resort and Casino, and we're told they're thankful that Eminem got involved to help them realize the whole thing was silly in the first place. The two perform loco together to let the world know that the beef is really over but all right guys hit that sub like and bell button comment down below who you want to see on the next remix of old town road oh and follow me over on social media at Devonte chisholm peace out